Y'all's and going guys, welcome back to the channel. We are here with another COD Mobile video and today we're actually going to be going over the best sensitivity and settings in the Battle Royale mode. Now I have already actually done a settings video about a month ago and it got 22,000 views so you know I have to do another one bro. But yeah, I'm going to go over all the sensitivity and settings that I use and along with that I'm going to give you tips and tricks to help find you the best sensitivity. But yeah, if you do go on to enjoy today's video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel and comment down below if you want to see a hood layout video. And now let's get right into the video. All right, boys. So starting off in the basic section, we have aim assist on, of course. ADS button for rotation on. Shotgun hit reminder. Now that basically shows how much damage you're doing when using a shotgun. Automated armor repair. I think you should actually have that off. Joystick auto sprint. I like to have auto sprint on just when I'm running around, rotating the zone. Uh, just auto sprinting. Fixed joystick. I don't really like having a fixed joystick, so I have a floating one. Continuous grenade throw, definitely do not have that on, because that is when, as soon as you press your grenade button, it actually throws it straight away, which isn't that good, I don't think. Quick weapon switch, I think you should have that on. Auto expand wingsuit, now basically, it will automatically pull out your wingsuit when falling from a high distance. And if you don't have this on, you have to use a separate button to actually activate the wingsuit. Auto use, definitely don't have that on. I don't know why they even added that into the game. And you can randomly healing midway fight. Like, what is that? Right, so damage number. Uh, damage number is when it shows how much damage you're doing to your opponent, which is actually decent, I think. But for me, I don't like it on my screen, so I have it off. It's nice to look around. I do have on for the parachute style. I think that's the best, I think. It helps you see where your opponents are landing, and uh, it gives you a bit of an advantage, I think. And you can actually see how it works. So this is slide to check around and then change direction is of course that. And display left fire button I do have on. Always sprint, I think you should have that on boys. FOV has to be at 90 bro. And then also uh, 80 for the third person only. Sound reminder, um, I would say this one is actually probably better because it's closer, but yeah. And for this, I would say have that on because it gives you a big advantage, but again, I don't like it on my screen, so I have that off. But if you want an advantage, have it on. Moving on to the graphics. I have them on medium, but I know a lot of people that play low just so they don't have any frame drops. But for me, I have an iPad Pro, so I don't get any frame drops either way. So I just have it at medium. Realistic for the graphic style. And then considering I'm only at medium, I only have real-time shadows and anti-analyzing. So I just have those both on just to make it a bit more realistic, a bit more cleaner. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Now going on to the sensitivity. All right, so BR mode sensitivity, here we go. Speed acceleration. Now for my multiplayer speed acceleration, I have at 120, which is extremely high, which, you know, I like to flick in multiplayer, but in BR, I don't flick at all, to be honest. So I have it at 90. You still need it a bit high just for that movement, but honestly, don't have it over 100. And I think 90 is perfect for Battle Royale. Sensitivity switch, switch while opening ADS, and that's the best, yeah. And then for the actual camera sensitivity, what the fuck? But yeah, for the camera sensitivity, third person sensitivity, I have on 100. I'm a high sense player, remember that, boys? 104 for the FPP view, uh, and then fire sensitivity, pretty much the exact same, but uh, a tiny bit higher. But yeah, here's all my sensitivity if you want to know what it is. I don't really recommend copying it. I know one way to actually figure out the perfect sensitivity for you, just go into a custom, a private match in Battle Royale, and aim at some of the targets in the map. It can be really anything, just aim at something so you can have an idea what your sensitivity should be. Gyroscope, I don't use it, so it doesn't really matter to me. Uh, moving on to the looting settings. Auto loot, I don't like that at all. It just makes my backpack full and I, I don't like it. Uh, medicines, armor repair. I pretty much that's the default 12, 4, and 2. I think you should keep that the same, I guess. For the optics, now this is actually pr a very good feature. For the assault rifles, now you don't want to have it to 3 or 4, because depending on what assault rifle, like the AK-47, you may want a higher uh, or longer scope, but for most assault rifles, you're only going to use holographics and reflexes. Uh, sniper rifles, the default sniper rifle scopes are probably the best, like the DLQ, Locust, so uh, don't have any equipped for that. LMGs, uh, pretty much the same as assault rifles, but they're a bit better at range, so times three is probably the max. SMGs, it's a short range weapon, so reflex holographic, uh, no no longer than that. And maximum rifles, pretty much everything, to be honest, I've just equipped everything. Uh, lethal and tactical. I've set it on all three, to be honest. I don't like too many grenades. Smoke grenade is honestly the only one I use in BR. But yeah, I recommend having it a bit low. For the vehicle settings, layout A, it's not really a big deal, you know, layout A is the simplest, so as of that. And that is actually it, so yeah, I've fired through that. Uh, if you have any questions, leave it in the comment section below and I will answer it. But that is pretty much it, uh, for the hood actually, I forgot to actually show my hood. 
for yeah, so let me actually go to that so here is my hood for the battle royale game mode um i play eight no seven fingers sorry seven fingers four on the left and three on the right but yeah, that is it for the best settings best sensitivity in con mobile battle royale hope you did enjoy and if it did help you make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel as i said before comment down below any questions you've got i will try and answer them as best as possible but as always i'll see you in the next one